What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Hashtag mug life. I live the mug life, and uh, who doesn't like Doctor Who? Doctor Who? Doctor Who? Who? Hey, look at this. Uh, I've discovered this. Uh, Doctor Who's on the BBC, if you didn't know. Hey, um, so I discovered this. It's a website called mugmadhouse.com, I believe. And they have all different types of mugs. And so I was kind of scouring them because I love drinking my Java from a cool mug. And I found this and I was like, oh man, I got to check this out. It's so kind of unique and cool looking. Uh, and it's the TARDIS. And unfortunately, what I did is I unboxed it here previously because when I got it, I heard little pieces of mug in the box. So fortunately, I just want to show you here that uh, I think in transit, we had some handling that leaves something to be desired because what you can see here is that the top of the ceramic mug is not in good shape. And it's unfortunate because this is actually a pretty significant top. You can see here that it's uh, pretty thick, kind of like the top of a like a sugar bowl or something. And here are the rest of the pieces. Now, the good thing about it is that it was all in this little bag. So I am hoping that the damage to the mug is limited to the top, which is something that I wouldn't have really needed anyway, uh, and that it didn't bust up the bottom here because this is really the most important piece and so far i will say it looks to be in good condition hallelujah uh that is awesome so hey let's go ahead and take a look at this obviously i have not taken a look at this mug at all here and pretty cool looking man it's got this beautiful blue finish it's got a typical mug handle on this side but obviously what makes this really different is that it is rectangular it's square we do have relief here on the outlines of the door with the, each of these panels we also have these designs the windows the uh, signage right there the logo and all that public call box police call box up there on the bottom blue with this exposed and then inside it is painted in ceramic all the way through so pretty cool I mean, in terms of overall height, it's kind of your typical mug height. But I actually suspect that this will probably hold more than most mugs. I don't know, you know, because it's square. It feels like there's just a lot of volume in it. I don't know. Maybe it's about the same, but it's just really cool. That is a conversation piece. If you know people who are Doctor Who fans, even though the top of this was broken, kind of doesn't really matter. You can see what it would look like if you had it. But I don't feel like I would be using the top anyway, right? Am I crazy about that or not, right? Um, I wouldn't be because I'd be drinking out of it. Now, <laughs> a couple of things to keep in mind is if you're drinking out of it and put your mouth here, the fluid, your liquid, your coffee, your delicious beverage might spill out the side. So I might uh, recommend kind of drinking it from the corner. So that's probably a, a drawback of the square rectangular mug over the round mugs. But it's the trade-off you gotta make if you wanna have something super wicked cool and stylish like this. I'm really impressed by this. Really, really cool. If you wanna find some other wicked cool mugs, check out Mug Madhouse. I'll put a link to this in the description, but uh, if you wanna pick up this one, you can certainly get that sucker there. I love mugs. Mug life, baby. Mug life. I'm gonna be checking out more, too. Peter Rompanda. Out. <laughs>